Yo, yo, welcome to Trippy Commentaries. Thank you for joining me here in Grand Theft Auto 5. I'm RJ. Today I wanted to talk about the next game in the Grand Theft Auto series. We're all assuming it'll probably be called Grand Theft Auto 6. But what I wanted to talk about was the main protagonist. There are a lot of reports that for the first time, main protagonist in the game will be female. I think that would be pretty cool. Now, mostly, it's probably just to get more attention to the game. Rockstar likes to do that. They like to do whatever is going to get the most attention for their game right before it releases. So I think we will see a female protagonist. Hopefully, she is a uber badass character because, in my opinion, I think the characters here in Grand Theft Auto V were a little bit disappointing. I thought that they could have been a little bit better. Trevor started off pretty cool, but it turned out he was a complete crazy motherfucker, and he wasn't very li likable. I still like to use him, especially in free roam mode. Franklin, to me, he, cl he complains a little bit too much. I still think he's okay, and I like his special ability, but I think they could have done better, especially if they made him more like CJ, who's my favorite character in GTA history for CJ from Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, the original uh, protagonist in San Andreas. Now, I think we will have a female protagonist, but it probably will not be the only main protagonist in the game. Uh, GTA 5 has three main protagonists, so I think that in GTA 6, they might take it up a notch to six. That would be pretty cool. It might be a little bit tough, but uh, it would make sense with the title, and it would give you a lot of different options, a lot of different characters, you know, possibly different races, so everybody gets a character that they can relate to. You know, you might have a gangster type. You might have maybe a uh, office kind of guy, someone who's doing some underhanded tactics who can help the, the ghetto people uh, take care of some heists. I hope heists come back in full force, but my main prediction, now that we have major reports that a female protagonist will be coming to Grand Theft Auto, I feel like that will be one of possibly six characters, maybe just four, maybe they just add one compared to GTA 5 where we have three now, the other thing I really want to see in GTA 6 is remote control vehicles. For those of you who played Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, that was a pretty cool feature. Um, in San Fierro, you had to control, I think it was a remote control RC plane. It wasn't easy, but it was cool flying around the city, dropping bombs on the uh, competitors of the comic book store. Hopefully they add that back. I think that'll be cool in the next gen, of course, current gen right now. I feel GTA 6 will probably be on the Xbox One, the PC, and the PS4, so it uh, shouldn't take too long for us to get it. They're going to use probably pretty close to this engine. It'll look better, but this looks fantastic as it is. Looks like we have a little passage right here. So hopefully we can see RC cars and RC vehicles added into the game. Let me know if you guys played San Andreas yourselves and you remember that uh, feature to the game because it's something I was hoping we'd get back. In Grand Theft Auto 4 when uh, we were in Liberty City there with Nico hopefully we see it again especially on this next gen here the Xbox one the PS4 RC vehicles it's one of a couple features I really want to see coming out in GTA 6 I'll make a wish list video I'm really looking forward to that game even though I know we still have a lot more to go here in this game still some DLC upcoming single-player DLC hopefully more to come online Hopefully we get the RC cars. We might have a female protagonist upcoming. That's going to be pretty cool. And uh, of course, let me know what you think about GTA 6. The last question I have is, where will it take place? I've heard a lot of people predicting Vice City. But my prediction is that it's not going to take place in Vice City. I need more mountains, more of a uh, you know, change of uh, terrain. If you're in Vice City, Florida, it's going to be too flat. I want Lost Ventures to come back. Hopefully San Fierro, which is like San Francisco, maybe even San Diego. We'll see. Hopefully we get some more mountainous regions so that way terrain plays a major, major part in the, of the role to the Grand Theft Auto franchise and driving around, pulling off stunts, and all other crazy stuff. Stay trippy, guys. I'll catch you in the next episode. We have a lot planned this week here, trippy commentaries. So, of course, stay tuned and stay trippy.